do I have your permission to hypnotize you? Get ready to experience something wonderful. Get ready to sleep. Tell me your name. The first time you tell me your name, you are going to tell me your actual name. However, every time thereafter that I ask your name, you will make up a different name. I'm sorry, and you are? Bill. Bill from? Melbourne. Mel your name is? Janet. Janet. Okay, and you're from? New Hampshire. And you, your name again? George. George. Okay, and I'm sorry, your name was Janet? Bubbles. Bubbles. <laughs> I'm sorry, did you say Bubbles? No, no, um, Phyllis. Phyllis, okay. And I'm sorry, your name again? Gene. What is your first name? Barbara. I'm sorry, Barbara? Cindy. Cindy, oh, I'm sorry. You are? Juanita. Juanita. Hi, what is your name, please? Allison. And you are? Shanaqua. I'm sorry? Shanaqua. Shanaqua, okay. And you are? Justin. Justin, okay. <laughs> I see the operation was a success, Justin. Hi, what is your name, please? Jeff. And you are? F from Simblis Jr. F from Simblis Jr. Of your name is? Peter Cottontail. Peter Cottontail. What's your name again? Speed Racer. Speed Racer, okay. I'm going to have you open your eyes. And when I do, unbeknownst to me, there is a split down the back of my pants. I can see the perfect sky is tall. I'm going to remove the number six from your memory. It never existed. How many fingers do you have? Ten. How many toes do you have? Ten. Perfect. Hold your hands uh, in front of you. Perfectly. Right up like that. So if I point to a finger, you'll start counting so we can check how many fingers you have. Here we go. Ready? One. Really loud. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I thought you said you had 10. Let's start backwards. Let's start with 10. Ready? 10, 9, 8, 7, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Could you use the extra finger? Probably. Okay. <laughs> Sir, in just a moment, I'm going to introduce you because you are the chief of an ancient warrior village. And you speak like the chief of an ancient warrior village. You are all in my village now. You're all in my village now. <laughs> I'm going to take all the men. I'll take all the men and chop them up into little pieces. Chop them up into little pieces. <laughs> To my house. To my teeth. Keep perfect balance. Sleep. Perfect balance. Now I'm going to really show you how powerful a lion can be. You are no longer the chief of an ancient village. You are an ancient Japanese warrior, and you only speak ancient Japanese. You are all in my village now. Look it up. Look it up. Look it up. And I'm going to take all the men. And I'm going to chuck them up into little pieces. You can put the sword away, don't you? And I'm going to take all the women. You, yeah. Back to my hut. Oh yeah, yeah. Where we're going to party all night long. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the chief's wife. Oh. And 
and she just heard, Chief eyes open, she just heard what the Chief said, and she is not Now, it just so happens, let me, let me make sure I understand. You speak both English and ancient Japanese, is that correct, my dear? That is correct. Thank you. Now, I, I understand you're very upset with your husband. Oh my gosh, she's in trouble! And you better... Trouble! Are you... Your last name is now the sound made by your favorite barnyard animal. Your first name is? Kiki. Kiki, and what is your last name? I'm sorry, I, I didn't quite catch Okay. What is your first name again? Garth. And your last name? I'm sorry, your name was? Kristen Kamrudu! And you are? And you're very upset because you paid a lot of money for the show and you think this is the worst show you have ever seen and you demand a refund from me. Money. So they say. What's, what's your name? Loretta. Well, we're supposed to be up here to be hypnotized and you're going on. Yeah. I think you're okay. okay. What do you think I should do about that? Hypnotize us and show us something that you can do. And did you pay any money for this? Like we paid money. Up. No, we didn't pay money. Yes, I paid money. I paid good money. <laughs> The first movie we're going to watch is the funniest comedy you have ever seen. It is so funny that you can't help but laugh out loud, louder and harder than you've ever laughed before. It's There's no business like show business. The funniest movie you've ever seen. It's so funny. 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 I say the words, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to stand up and tell me to shut up. Talk too much. It's like I didn't shut up. <laughs> Why are you telling me to shut up? Am I saying something wrong? You keep saying, ladies and gentlemen, you keep saying that, and things shut up. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Right. Anyhow, folks, ladies and gentlemen, I'm really. Here for just a second. Just come on up here for one second. All right, and if, if you come up here, I'll shut up, okay? If you come up here, I'll promise to shut up. Shut up. All right. <laughs> I apologize. 
apologize. Anyhow, ladies and gentlemen, sleep! <laughs> Wish it was really that young.